Why is it so hard to find Ditto now? Just gonna keep the camera turned this way for a second. Try and get the stuff to switch around. Is that a Rotom? I wouldn't have expected to see this here, so this has to be a Ditto. Nope, it's actually a Rotom. What? <laughs> Now I'm going insane because other Pokemon are starting to spawn here. Maybe every Pokemon is in this area. Maybe. Please, just one, just one ditto. Just one ditto. That's all I need. And I think once you've caught a Ditto, you can actually tell what ones are actually a Ditto. Because you can zoom in on them and they'll actually be a, like you'll say Ditto. But I don't think that's going to be the case until I catch one, so... Basically the only time I need to know is when I can't know. Also, you just fought that, cool. I'm just fighting everything, wow. I guess that's a good thing. I'm expecting to see the side of the screen just- it's gonna say Rotom defeated Ditto, and I'm gonna be very upset with myself. Maybe it is just close to the other side of this area here. Maybe I just need to stand where the Ditto icon is and then wait. Or something, I don't know. Ditto? Ditno. Also, Rotom's low, I should probably, probably should heal that. Do I go back down? Or do I stay up here? I'm very tempted to just go down. hi -ya! That's how you get the Ditto to appear. Except it's not a Ditto, so it doesn't- this, it, I just lied to you. Come on. I need the ditto. I'm falling! Into the void. Hello. Are you a ditto? Nope, you're a wingull. There's a Gyarados. Just right there. Why am I down here again? <laughs> you put me up on the, the platform and then you take me back down again. I don't know if there's going to be a Ditto down here, to be honest. It feels like there could be, but I don't think there is. Well, so I need to catch this, I think, so I might, I might as well do that. Just to bring up my Pokedex. Without too much extra work. One, two, three. Nope. Well, I could try again, but I think I'm just going to throw a, a, another ball, different ball. Nice catch with a Dusk Ball. I think I'm going to have to head back up again, because that's the only option I can think of. At this point, Shockwave. 60 power. Never misses. Advice? Get rid of Thunder Wave. Okay. I mean, everything down here I would expect to see, basically, so... It's about finding something that I wouldn't expect to see. To find a Ditto. I need more icons on the map to show me where I'm supposed to look or something. I don't know. I wonder if you can find it in the lighthouse, like up at the top of the lighthouse or something. I don't think they spawn up there, so I don't don't think so. But I don't know, so. Obviously I don't know. Meowth, another Rotom. Uh, 
I just want this ditto. What is that? Well, that's not supposed to be here, right? Question mark, maybe? Nope, it's this, uh, cool. It was supposed to be here, so apparently. Don't look. You don't want to see that. There we go, oh my goodness. Oh, like 10 minutes later or something, wow. Thundershock, please don't kill it. Should have used Transform, of course. I should have just used a Quick Ball. Why did I just use a Quick Ball? Why, why, why? You find a Ditto, use a Quick Ball immediately. Help, ah. It's fine. Everything's fine. I just need to not kill this Pokemon and it'll be fine. It's still night time. This Dusk Ball will still work. Let me try one more Thundershock. Or whatever my, my attack is. Yeah, Thundershock. Right, it doesn't do much. Why does its moves do more, more than my moves? It's fine. Nest Ball's not gonna work until I switch Pokemon, probably. Ultra Ball! I'm literally just chipping its health down. As best I can at this point, just because I just that's all I can really do other than just throwing the rest of my balls forever. Just a ran out of moves we've been going on for so long. Also, now I can't damage it without killing it. <laughs> damage by recoil? You mean all that? All that time? That I spent searching for that ditto. And all that time, I battled it, and all those balls I threw. Ah, uh, uh, uh. Well, so I went back to the Pokemon Center to heal, and now I'm back. The icon's not on the map anymore? So, uh, is it still here? Is it gone, or...? Did I... did it? did I... No, it's here. It's here, cool, thank you. Thank you, game, for not absolutely ruining me. Just yet. Wow, that didn't take long. Cool, thank you, game. Why didn't I use a quick ball? I never learn. I think that's as close to zero as I'm gonna get. I'm mad. I've wasted so many balls. Only to have that just destroy itself. I'm gonna go buy more balls. <laughs> Maybe some good ones if I can. I don't even know at this point. I've been trying to catch a ditto for like 30 minutes now. I still haven't managed to do it. <sighs> Nest ball. I'll by many, I don't know. I have basically no balls left now, so... I just want Ultra Balls. Where can I buy Ultra Balls? I think I can buy them from a shop, but I... Yeah. I need to actually do that. What I really need is some way to, to make the Pokemon go to sleep or something. But I don't think I have that, so... Or anything else I can really do. Maybe I could use Kamala for this. Maybe. Just to try and get this to sleep. Oh, right. It doesn't affect it. Right. Cool. Hang on. Can I run from this quickly? Can't get away. You've got to be kidding me. 
That was almost... I almost worked with a quick ball. <laughs> oh my goodness. Finally. After all these years. Oh my gosh. I caught a ditto finally. It only took like 40, 50 minutes. Oh my goodness, okay, cool, let's go to the boxes. Let me get rid of this Kamala because I don't need it. And because I don't really need any of these other ones, I might also... Wow, I'm really running out of box space. Uh, I might also select a few things here. No, nope, hang on, the selection is really weird. Trust me, it's weird. Okay, where's the ditto, please? <laughs> where's the ditto? There it is. Grab out that ditto. A ditto is both, or is neither male or female, and can be any Pokemon, which is quite, quite ideal for getting eggs, basically, for breeding up Pokemon. It, and, and because of the way it works, you can't actually get more ditto by breeding. So it's basically 100% chance of getting the Pokemon that you want. Let's make a sandwich, if I can, hopefully, maybe. Although I don't really have the ingredients I need for this egg power times, like, level 2 egg power thing. That's fine. I don't even need, I don't think, to make a sandwich, possibly. I think with enough time I should just get what I need, so... More, more waiting, although I should also probably buy ingredients and have the egg power up, just to make sure it's working fine. If you see the music notes, I think that's an indication that things are doing what you want them to, possibly. And if you don't have a ditto, you have to have Pokemon that are similar in the same egg groups, which is usually just the type that they are in. But sometimes it's like... The, how humanoid they are. But it's it's really hard to know what that what egg group they're in, so... I'd recommend looking up... What, like, just look up that... Look, look them up online and you'll find the egg group that they belong to. Or the egg groups that they belong to. And what other Pokemon are in that egg group. Oh, it's hello, Gimme Ghoul. I'm also gonna buy extra ingredients because I need them. Okay, sandwich time. Ultra sweet sandwich. Yup. Yup. I still feel like this is a lot harder than it needs to be. Also, I don't think this is the sandwich that I thought it was. That's okay. I thought there was a different sandwich, which didn't need the... the herbs, whatever it is. Maybe I missed a recipe somehow. Because I don't remember the basil. Whoa! Look at all those Pokemon! It's also good to check with your Pokemon to see how they're doing. Get the friendship up. There's a Pokemon inside the basket. Do you want to take it? Yes, I do. We should get more because I've used the egg power up, so... Although I think it also depends on how many Pokemon you have out... ...at your picnic to how quickly... ...eggs will appear in the basket, so... I 
I mean, I'd be content with just one, but I'd also like to get just like a, a little bit more than <laughs> just a little bit more than that. Another egg. Another egg. Doesn't look like there's anything else right now. Guess I'll pack that up then. I'm 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 pretty good with three eggs. I could have probably had more than that, but I'm I'm pretty good with just three. So. Okie dokie. Now, something else I should mention about Pokemon eggs is you have to step to get the steps up. By, like, to hatch them, you have to walk around with them. Which means we're gonna have to do a fair bit of that. Ah, uh, but some Pokemon have flame bodies. Like, the, the ability flame body, which allows them to hatch eggs faster. So if I have Fletchender out, these eggs will probably hatch faster. And it doesn't actually take that long to hatch some eggs. But it also depends on the Pokemon and how rare it is, which since this is a star type, it's probably going to take a bit. So I'm going to start running around and see how far I get. Oh, there's one, apparently. I'm, I'm not even that far away from where I started. So is this what I actually need or is this actually, is this just going to break me completely? Nope, I got a few Coco. Nice. Look at how derpy he is. <laughs> it's beautiful. But this is a good way to get more of the starter Pokemon to trade with your friends, so you can actually get all the different starters, so. Yeah, these these hatched quite quickly. I thought this was going to take a lot longer because they were rarer. But I guess not, so. I don't know what happens if you breed a Ditto and a Ditto, but I don't think you can, possibly. Another few Coco. I think I might be trading two of these, at the very least. I don't know about all three of them, but yeah, I'll, I'll be trading some of these for other ones, so try and get some of the other starters, possibly. But there we go. Got some few cocoa to trade. Oh, let's put them into the box for now, then. Is there a space in here? I guess so. Let me just move that to there for the moment. Because that makes the most sense to me. And let's get the rest of the team, which I put somewhere. I'm sure. Put them there. Okay. Gonna set Rotom to the lead for now. Let's go to the gym. <laughs> Before I lose my mind and stay away from everything forever. i just just fly there. It's been like an hour since I started trying to catch this ditto. <laughs> that took far longer than it should have. Far longer. But it was worth it for the, the few Coco now. And now I can trade them so I can get... Quaxley and Sprigatito. I, I mean, I, 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 I assume I can get both of those at some point, probably. Depends on who I trade with and what starters they picked, so. At the very least, I can guarantee I'm getting Sprigatito, so. I'm pretty sure, at least. Well now, Jeremy. You appear to be progressing well in your gym circuit. What's this now? Is this kid that, that is that the, is that kid that I've been hearing so much about? Hey, kiddo! I heard you. You're like way too good at battling, yeah? I'm not that good. I'm just over leveled. Pa, you can't fool me that easily. No need to h play humble, you hear? This young lady would be Eureka. That's me, Rika here, at your service. And hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get intimidated or anything. She's a little... for... <laughs> for sequel. I, I can't say words. Shall we say. But like myself, she is a member of the Elite Four. What? I wasn't trying to be funny. Anyway, hmm. Tell you something, kiddo. You look fun. Like, interesting. At a glance, anyway. Naturally, he is one of our Academy's esteemed students. 
Oh, haha, yeah, that checks out. But the battles you'll face at these gyms really... <laughs> ratchet up the f farther you go. Indeed, your average trainer ab abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. But not you, right kiddo? See, when you when you hit up the champion ass assessment, you show these gyms what you've got. Best of fortunes to you. Well, that's not intimidating whatsoever. Jeremy, I heard you're re reunited uh, Kofu with his wallet. I can't thank you enough. This is, though... Though this is a little irregular, please consider your gym test passed. Woohoo! Are you ready to challenge gym leader Kofu, the surfing chef? Yes, I am. Very well. Allow me to show you to the battle court. Loading. I really like how the gyms, uh, the gym, how the gyms look at night. Old man Kofu, play with us, come on! I would be honored if you would try a new item from my restaurant's menu as well. Sorry everybody, I've got some business to take care of as gym leader real quick like. I'm keeping someone waiting, you see? Please forgive me. I need to do this first. Okay. Popular. Hey, uh, step right up. I've been waiting for you. Thanks for the help over in Porto Marinda. Uh, Marinada. You did a mighty fine job. And now that I've got the legendary seaweed, I can make some real quality dishes with it. But don't expect me to go easy on you in battle here. Okay. Here we go. At the auction, we battle with buying and selling. At, the, at my gym, we battle in a more traditional sense. Moves and tactics are ever changing as this raging sea. I'm gonna serve you a full course of water type Pokemon. Don't try to eat him up. E eat him though. You were challenged by Gym Leader Kofu. Sent out Veluza. I think I might. I feel a bit indebted to you, but don't expect me to go easy on you just because of that. I'm just thinking about terrestrializing, but I can't really do that with um, Rotom because Rotom, if if its its terror type is Ghost, so I'm just gonna have to stick with what I have right now. So and it's not like any of its moves are gonna be more effective as Ghost. So buffeted by the sandstorm that's just here because we're next to the desert. Uh, what trio? I haven't seen Wug Trio. Oh my goodness. I'm assuming this is, um... The evolution of... Wiglet, probably. Because it's, like... Diglett and Doug Trio, but it's... Wiglet and Wug Trio. Sandstorm went away, which is nice. I think. I guess that... I guess that can just happen, probably, so... Headbutt... Leaf Storm? That's better. Better than the Storm, at least. We are really overleveled. But I guess there's a few more gems we can go to as well. Crabon. Crab. 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 I can't even say that. Crab Omnimal. Omni. Yeah. It's fine. The tides ebb and flow. It's time for a raging tidal surge. Crabom, I can't. I can't say it. Ah! 
It's it. I can hear. I can say it in my head, but I can't say it in my mouth. Prepare to prepare the rigging for a big transformation. My Pokemon's gonna rock the boat. Crab om om oh, omnibal. Yeah, I don't know. I know what it's going for, but I can't say it, so. Ow, slam. It's fine. I just need one more solid hit. Also, the sandstorm is still going. It just visually went away for some reason. There goes my last leaf storm. Will it be enough? Nope. Gonna have to switch Pokemon for this. One hour old man Kofu special coming right up. Hang on tight or get swept up by the dice gone. That was really quick. Crab hammer, which is gonna beat me up. What am I gonna switch to? Da da ba 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 da da. It'd be really funny if it died to the sandstorm. Uh, anyway. Gas. Maybe a river of room? Try ball. It's not very effective. Oh boy. I thought that would be effective, but I guess not. I wouldn't have thought it would be effective the other way around, so. But maybe it's neutral or something. Poison jab. There we go. And then we go. Where's Cash Punch to learn the move Future Sight? Two turns after the move's used, this a hunk of psychic energy attacks the target. That's cool. I wants to forget it, but I want to learn it, to be honest. It might be good to keep the physical mud shot. Maybe I will get rid of it for now. It's an interesting move, and it's got a lot of power, it, but I don't, I don't know if I can keep it, so... I might come back to it, possibly. Volton Veluza, you're a lovely, lively one, aren't you? A little too lively, if you, if I do say so myself. Thank you for the money. I really need it after everything I've spent on recently. Gah! <laughs> Loss of refreshing. As, as refreshing as the air at the morning market. I'm just a help. like a helpless little Magikarp to you, eh? Flopping around all willy nilly. You got me good, I tell ya. Wh what a great catch you are. Just like a master fisher, you held on. Tight till the last second and reeled in victory. Now it's time to hand over a gym badge to you. And let's get a real good photo together using a pose I've been waiting, wanting to you to try out for a while now. <laughs> oh my goodness. Absolutely mad. Like I'm just, I'm just mad man. <laughs> Crazy. It's amazing though. With four gym badges in your possession, Pokemon up to, of up to level 40 will be easier to catch and listen to you when you ask them to do things. Wait, am I supposed to be less than what I'm currently leveled at? Or maybe I'm supposed to have already done the other gym. Let me throw this in too as an extra special bonus. I'm sure you can make good use of it. TM22 Chilling Water. All right, it's about time I headed on my on back to my restaurant and get to prepping for the next wave. You come back to see me again now, you hear? And there we go. I should probably stop recording since I've been recording for an hour and 36 minute on these two videos. And there's still more more stuff. Oh, Jeremy. Hola. 
caught you just as you finished up in here, huh? Nice work. That puts you, you, you four badges in now, right? Man, that's awesome. I can't believe you're halfway through your gym journey already. Your efforts are bearing so much fruit so quickly. It makes me just want to just challenge you to, the, to a battle right here, right now. But I'm going to have to wait. Because I put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader. Dang it. When I battle you, I want to do it under the best possible conditions, which means this time I've got to uh, ask for a ring check. God, this is the worst timing ever. Sorry, Jeremy. Forgive me. Forgive me. Okay, you are forgiven. Anyway, that is it for now. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.